YouTube, Eugene here with a review on the Osama Sentai King Oger Sentai Hero Series Vinyl Figures. Yes, friends. And so here they are, friends, our 47 Sentai. And so let me go ahead and introduce them. We have Kawagatha Oger, Tombo Oger, Kamakiri Oger, Papillon Oger, and Hachi Oger. And so, friends, this Sentai Steam is Arthropods Fantasy and Raw Team making this a first insect bug themed Sentai. Also, a first for a Violet Purpose Sentai for the five core team. And of course, friends, my dream team of a five core team, as I always wanted a Violet Purple Sentai of a five core team as a start of a series. And so, anyway, friends, the theme fits so well with the suits and designs of the King Ogers. So, again, the Sentai Hero series is a line that started in 2001 when Gal Ranger was airing that are figures that used to stand at a length scale of 5.5 inches tall, as these are downsized to a 4.5 inch scale. So, I'm guessing these are the new scale of the Sentai Hero series vinyl figure line. And so, as the Sentai Hero series line been at the 5.5 inch scale for 21 years, also, friends, when you squeeze them, yeah, they're soft. So, the soft vinyl figures. But for years, we had the 5 core team being released as a vinyl figure when the series starts. But for the past two years, we only had just the leader of the team as a vinyl figure and not the rest of the team. And so the last Sentai to have a 5 core team of vinyl figures released was Kira Major back in 2020. So it is nice to have a 5 core team release again in the vinyl figure standard and in this new length scale. So let me go ahead, speaking of length scale here, let me go ahead and just do a quick comparison. So here is Don Mobotaro from last year. And so you can see the difference now. So pretty much an inch, you know, downsize here. All right, so take a look at the figures one by one and we'll start off with Kawagatha Oger. And so his main color is red in this very nice, shiny, glossy paint on the vinyl. As the others will have this as well, but making this very accurate to the show. As the show has that really nice shininess. And so getting a close up of the visor. The visor has a nice design of the stag beetle. Love the uh, top jaws sticking out like that on the top. And then uh, pretty much got the stag beetle legs right there on the mouthpiece there. And got the stag beetle eyes on both sides of the visor in a nice metallic green. And so the chest, the chest pretty much in this armored design sculpt. And pretty much it's not that real bulky armor on the suit. And so anyway, getting a little close up here, uh, but got his kingdom emblem, which is the emblem of Shugatum on the side of his chest. And got the uh, shoulder pads as well here. But look at that nice shine we're getting from the paint on the vinyl. Very nice. And so, anyway, on the left arm here, uh, got the half cape, which is molded to the arm. Which makes it look weird on this side here compared to the other. And so, anyway, and I feel that the, uh, the half cape is also missing some silver paint for the outer lining. And then got the nice uh, silver elbow cuffs on both sides. On the torso, we're seeing a different shade of red on the suit, like a maroon. And it's on the arms and legs as well. So he's got the two-tone colors of red and maroon. And so, anyway, getting a little close up here, there is his older holder, which is in black and the king's hotline in the center, like a buckle, but in a, in a black and silver, which you can see the details of the King Oger's emblem a little. But uh, anyway, and uh, right here, there is his holster for the Oger caliber, which is in the Sinchi's color and not black. And so uh, anyway, going down a little further here, uh, you can see got the nice sculpted knee pads, the armorish look on the knees, which looks nice there. And he's got the silver for the boot cuffs. 
on the back, uh, pretty much missing silver paint for the elbow and boot cuffs. Also uh, missing black paint on the older holder. And we're seeing more of the half cape on the back. But of course, friends, missing paint on the back of the vinyl figures has always been a issue here. But we're still seeing some nice details and seeing more of that very nice glossy paint, which looks very nice, that very nice shine all on the back. And so anyway, so here is the tag. As you can see, it pretty much says Osama Sentai King Oger. Right here it says Sentai Hero Series, Kawagatha Oger. And then right here it says in English, Kawagatha Oger. And we got a better look at the kingdom emblem of Shugodom. And so anyway, so articulation uh, pretty much on these vinyl figures are always in the arms and in the waist. And that's pretty much it on articulation on these vinyls here. And so just to let you know, I am doing the articulation on Kawagatha Oger only and the rest are the same. So I do like the armorish look on the suits and friends. It gets better on the other four King Ogers. Next here is Tombo Oger. And so same mold as Kawagatha Oger. But this time all in blue as the vinyl still got that nice glossy paint. Uh, but with a different visor design and kingdom emblem. As the visor. The visor has that nice design of the dragonfly. As the top, the eyes in a nice metallic blue. And the wings of the dragonfly on the visor. And the tail end of the dragonfly on the mouthpiece. As the action hero figure of Tombo Oger is missing this. And so there is his king, uh, kingdom emblem on his chest. Which does look nice. Which is the emblem of Nikospa. And then uh, uh, got a darker shade of blue on the torso. Arms and legs and again that two-tone colors which looks nice on the suit and so anyway so same suit pattern as Kawagatha Oger with the armor uh, design chest the cape the elbows and uh, boot cuffs in silver um, so anyway and then uh, there is the uh, the king's hotline and Oger holder pretty much the same thing here and then uh, here is the back of the vinyl and so, anyway, and then uh, here is his tag, which pretty much says, Osama Sentai King Oger, uh, Sentai Hero Series, Tombo Oger, and it says Tombo Oger in English. And we got a better look at the Kingdom Emblem of Nikospa. So here's the Kirame Blue Vinyl figure with the Tombo Oger Vinyl figure. And as you can see, the blue is an actual blue on Kirame Blue. As Tombo Oger's blue is a darker blue due to that glossy paint they used on the vinyl. But it's nice and different. It looks like a little too dark than the blue from the past vinyl figures that we've already gotten. But the blue on Kirame Blue is close to the blue on Tombo Oger in the show. So next here is Kamakiri Oger. And so here we go with the females now. And so nice female mode on the vinyl figure. All in yellow as the female modes are always shorter and a little uh, thinner than the male modes. So still got that very nice shiny glossy paint on the vinyl. But with a different visor design and kingdom emblem. And so speaking of the visor, uh, take a look at the visor. As the visor has a very nice praying mantis design as the eyes are in a nice purple with the sickle arms on the visor and body as the mouthpiece. And uh, we got right here her kingdom emblem on her chest, uh, uh, which does look nice, which is the emblem of Ishibana. And then uh, right here, uh, we, uh, we got the orange, which on the vinyl looks like a metallic orange on the sides of the torso, arms, and legs. Pretty much part of the two-tone colors. And that orange um, does look good with the yellow. It really does. And so, uh, and pretty much on the suit here. And so pretty much uh, same suit pattern um, as the last two here. So anyway, and then uh, here is the back of the vinyl. 
And so anyway, so here is the tag. Um, it pretty much says Osama Sendai King Oger, Sentai Hero Series, Kamikiri Oger, and then right here it says Kamikiri Oger in English. And so anyway, we pretty much got a better look at the kingdom emblem of Ichibana. Also, friends, uh, due to that armorish style on the suit, there is no skirt like we've seen in the past of other female senshis. So here is the Lupin Yellow vinyl figure with the Common Carry Oger vinyl figure. As the yellow on Lupin Yellow is an actual yellow, as Common Carry Oger's yellow is a lighter yellow. Again, this is due to that glossy paint they use on the vinyl. So we went from a little darker or an actual color to a lighter, little lighter color. And I guess in this new generation of Sentai Hero Series vinyl figures. So here is Papillon Oger and another nice female mode of the vinyl figure. All in purple and still got that nice glossy paint on the vinyl. But I so love the different shades of purple on this vinyl. So same female mode as Kamikari Oger but different visor design and kingdom emblem. And so getting a close-up of the visor, as the visor has that nice butterfly design, the eyes are in yellow, the wings look nice on the visor, and got the tail end of the butterfly on the mouthpiece. Got her kingdom emblem on the side of her chest, which is the emblem of Gokan. Got the uh, purple on the sides of the torso, arms and legs part of the two-tone colors which looks uh, nice on the suit with the violet and purple and so anyway so same suit pattern as the last three but uh anyway and then uh here is the back of the vinyl here and so here is her tag uh which pretty much says osama sentai king oger sentai hero series Papillon Oger, and right here it says Papillon Oger in English here. And then um, well, we got a better look at the kingdom emblem of Gokan right here, which looks nice. I like that uh, that emblem. And uh, friends, uh, like uh, Kamakiri Oger, she doesn't have a skirt due to the armorish style on the suit. So here is the Geki Violet vinyl figure with the Papillon Oger vinyl figure. So Pretty much purple versus purple, male mode versus female mode. As the purple on Geki Violet is a straight up purple. As Papillon Oger's purple is a straight up violet with that nice glossy paint shine on the vinyl. But Papillon Oger is still the first purple senshi of a five core team. So last but certainly not least, friends, here is Hachi Oger. And so same mode as Kawagatha Oger and Tambo Oger, but this time all in black. And God, friends, that glossy paint still looks nice, but with a different visor design and kingdom emblem. And so the visor has that nice design of the bee slash wasp. And the whole helmet sculpt looks good on Hachi Oger. As Toei confirmed, he is based off of a yellow hornet, which is strange that they named him after a bee. So uh, anyway, so there's the head in silver, the eyes in that red wine color, and the wings, the wings in silver, love this sculpt. And the mouthpiece is the tail end with the stinger, which is in yellow and black. Got his kingdom emblem on the side of his chest, which is the emblem of Tofu. And then uh, we got the uh, gray on the sides of the torso, arms, and legs. And I love the two-tone colors they picked for the uh, for a black senshi suit with the black and gray. Really nice overall. I mean, and that paint really got a nice glossy shine to it. But uh, anyway, so friends, same suit pattern from the last four. And so, uh, and then here is the back of the vinyl here. And then uh, here is his tag. Uh, it says Osama Sentai King Oger, Sentai Hero Series, Hachi Oger. And right here it says Hachi Oger in English here. And, and we got a better look at the kingdom emblem of Tofu. 
So here is the Yuso Black vinyl figure and the Hachi Oja vinyl figure. As the black on Yuso Black is a straight up black. As Hachi Oja's black has that very nice glossy paint. So it's got a shine than Yuso Black. Final thoughts. Overall, I dig the suits and designs of the King Ogers as the visors has the insect bug theme and the suits got the Kings and Knights theme and a new era in the Sentai Hero series line with new painting and new lane scale. And again, if you are a collector, you can customize these for your own purpose as these don't have to be perfect. So yes, friends, yes, I so 100% recommend these and we got more coming as far as this King Oja toy line is concerned. So more fun is coming with this Sentai. So all I got to say is good luck and happy hunting. These are very cheap little vinyl figures, even though they've been downsized. And so again, good luck and happy hunting. And so friends, that's it for this review. Please check out my blog phone and make sure friends you hit that bell up on the video. And of course my friends review on the Osama Sentai King Ogers Sentai Hero Series vinyl figures. I hope you enjoy. Well my friends, I'm Eugene. I'm signing good day. And my friends, I'll most assuredly see you next time. Bye friends.